Hey y'all, Irix guy here. I did an unboxing video of the Passage 1 tent from REI. You can see right there it says Passage 1. And now I'm going to do a setup video. And also you can see sitting on top of it, you've got my uh, solar panel. So while I'm establishing this campsite, I'm also charging my solar device that will enable me to keep my iPhone and GoPros and other technology charged throughout the evening. So without further ado let's get started with this passage one so tent this is setup. the first piece of the uh, of the rei passage one tent now this is an optional piece you need to buy it's called the footprint uh, basically this will go down first and it'll help to uh, to create a better moisture barrier between you and the ground okay so i've got the footprint positioned on the ground uh, one thing you want to make sure that the wider part is uphill because that's where your head's going to go and the narrow part's downhill if you're on a hill and you'll notice that I put the stakes and I just made it tight each corner, not too tight to rip it. But I put the stake at the end, leaving the grommet open because the grommet's where the, uh, where the tent poles are going to go. And I also laid down on it to make sure that I didn't have any, uh, any sharp rocks or sticks because now's the time to check for that. So the next step of the process was putting the actual tent on top of the footprint. And as you can see, those, uh, that webbing there is black. And I just put the end of the, uh, the tent part of the webbing underneath the stake that was already there connected to the, to the footprint. And then this end is orange, and I did the same thing there. So the color coding of the, of the webbing makes it idiot proof for most idiots. So, so far so good. Now let's continue. I'm going to put the poles up. Here we are with the, uh, the tent pitched. Something that I like that you can see the bottom of these poles are black to match the black uh, end. And then the other side's not because it's orange. So that's a, uh, a very nice reminder of which, which direction the poles should go. Just very easy to pitch. It was only two poles. And you can see in the middle I just crisscrossed them. Like all REI products, very good build quality. Um, you got this nice mesh netting up here to store your stuff. And just a sign of good design is that when you put stuff in there, you put it in from that end and it won't fall out that end. So with your head bent up here, you won't wake up with something falling on your face. So now let's put the rain fly on. So here we are fully assembled with the rain fly attached. And you can see it looks a little bit wider now. And that's because this part over here is the vest vestibule where you can store your uh, your gear or uh, you know maybe it's raining you want to cook you can cook in there actually this zips the other way to open you can tell I just got this tent because if that that way there's two zippers And then we zip this one up. And then, as with most all REI products, you got you got a little hook right there so you can uh, you can hold this open if you want to. But I'm gonna do another step where you can see me inside, and I'm 6'2. So it's it's good space. Hey y'all, Irix guy here. Now if you haven't checked it out, check out my uh, assembly video of this REI Passage 1 tent and then also my review of the air rail. But as you can see, the air rail now is fully inflated and it's inside my tent. Uh, now I'm, I'm a little over six foot tall. I'm 6'2". Uh, this is the largest air rail that they, uh, that they sell at REI. It's the long wide. It says 50, 25 by 78. So I'm gonna get in here and demonstrate how this works for a person that's six foot, two inches tall, both the tent and the air rail. It's very comfortable. Feels like a premium mattress at a top quality hotel. I've got plenty of room. I've got my vestibule right here that I can zip if it gets really cold. I got my gear up here. If it's warm weather, I can take the rain fly off and you've got a full skylight. Just an incredible tent for someone that's tall. Like I said, I'm 6'2". I weigh over 200 pounds 
and this tent is great for me. So share this video with others. Subscribe if you haven't already. YouTube.com forward slash Irix guy. Y'all have a good day.